Like, so you get sprayed with a water bottle. That's what I thought. No wonder the poor creatures are so hard to find anymore. One volume seems to be missing. Place the last volume on the mounted combat into the book. You hear a screeching metal. Aha, so I had to raid their homes to get in here. Ah, treasure chests. This is good. This is very good. And there's the other ones over there. That is like not much. Ooh, there's another book somewhere in here. Oh, is it? It's probably this thing right here to show us how to do it. Nope. <laughs> Hmm. Maybe this one? Air machines? We have to come back here anyways. If we don't find it... If he doesn't give us it as a reward... I wonder if we... Can we, like, just bust it down? I have failed in the ah, test. no you can't. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Thought those looked a little interesting. I didn't see the other one though. He might he might give us it as a reward though. It also might be in one of these things. We didn't really look in this stuff, I don't think, did we? Found it. <laughs> Found it! It's all good now, son. Infected with a wailing death. Yeah, so basically, these guys did the did the classic, <laughs> you know, the classic smallpox blanket thing that may have happened, you know, a couple hundred years ago. It seems like that's uh that's what they're going here, going for here with the storytelling. But uh, it's all right. We got the cure. This time we got the cure, all right? Ooh, a strong holy trap kit. I wonder... I wonder how trap builds work in this game. You know? Like, I'm curious as to how they work. It's just kind of one of those things. Why are you glowing blue? Like, what about you in particular? It was just like leftover. Hmm. Yeah, I'm glad I went this way last. That way I had all the books and didn't need to backtrack there. All right. I'll be back. You stay calm. We'll, uh, we'll get your tribe situation under control. Find out why they gave you all these blankets with the disease on them, knowing it would cause problems. So he's kind of the reason why the elk tribe started a war with them then. Seems like a uh, good reason to get court martialed, if not executed. <laughs> Which I'm pretty sure is. Uh, Which would kind of happen. I'd be surprised if they just let him go. But then again, you never know. He may also just be that dumb. And didn't know any better. Which would still probably make him lose his position in charge, but... Oh, that's right, I gotta... No, wait, no, 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 we did that. Never mind. What am I talking about? I was like, we gotta turn that quest in. But we, we got it. Ooh, this might level us up. This quest. Okay, you contaminated the elk tribe with these plague infected blankets. So, what if I did? Ah, okay, so you did know better. Alright, well. Youth Guard are nothing but primitive savages. Their time is over. We have the strength to remove them from their land, and that gives us the right to remove them. These blankets change nothing. We are at war here. The Youth Guard are the enemy. Or did you forget that? They allied themselves with Luskin. The only reason the Elk Tribe joined Luskin is because they were promised a cure for the plague you gave them. 
You don't really believe that, do you? You think if I hand over the cure to the Elk Tribe, we'll suddenly abandon their Luskin allies? Not that I have a cure on me. I know you have a cure, and I'll hand it over. Okay, let's not do anything crazy. You attack me, and every soldier in this fort will come to the defense of their commander. I'm a reasonable man. I don't know if every person will come to help. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a quick little save here. I think I'll just take the cure from your cold, dead hands instead. Nope, they're gonna defend him. I was hoping maybe, uh, maybe they wouldn't. <laughs> Okay, fine. Be 500 gold, not a coin more. Hello. We'll just uh, re-roll that real quick. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love being able to re-roll things. <laughs> I love it. Love being able to re-roll things. All right, let's go ahead and talk about this. Okay. Drive a hard bargain, but I guess 500 is better than what I'll get if I let them die or let them all die. Okay, it's a deal. Here's the cure. Change your mind decide you'd rather exterminate these Uthgard after all. Just bring me back the head of their leader, Zokan. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have business to attend to. Yeah, okay, sure. You trash. I got, I got like half a mil on me. <laughs> I could have just paid 3k, man. I really could have. What the heck happened to my weight? Excuse me? My buff fell off. No, my strength buff. Why did it fall off? Oh my gosh, I'm not allowed in this area. I gotta walk all the way back. <laughs> I gotta walk all the way back, dude. No. Oh wait, no, I don't. I'm just dumb. It's my belt of fire giant strength. That's what I was missing. Now we're good. I'm sitting there just like... I wasn't wearing a, a belt. Or not belt, but a, a buff for that. Where the heck do I get Dalen's spear? Because I know for a fact it wants me to give him a spear. I need to look up where to find the spear, probably. And again, it might be somewhere in here. Maybe we can get it as like a reward. Because I definitely didn't pick up any spear. Might have to look up where it is just to make sure I get it. I'm pretty sure I have everyone else's item on me. The oak seed, I guarantee, is an item. I don't know about the rags. I can't see the rags being a necessary item, but... We shall find out. Oh yeah, did I loot all of these? I did not. Alright, let's go talk to the uh, this guy again. I'm surprised with all the... Uh all the people complaining, it, uh, made me sit there and, you know, it was an urn in here. Ashes of the Running Wolf? Interesting. Really glad I found that, because I guarantee that's some sort of item. I just feel like the spear is going to be here. Zokan. My people wither and die from the plague. If they are not cured, the name of Zokan Thunderer will be remembered as the Uthgard chieftain who could not save his tribe from extinction. Don't worry, Zokan. I have a tribe, or I have a cure for the plague right here. Take it to heal your people. I thank you for this, Ateres. With this cure, my shamans will heal our tribe. You've saved the people of the Elk. We are children of the land. We have no gold or treasure to give you, but take this spear. <laughs> it 
It is a treasure of the elk tribe, long handed down from father to son among us. You have earned it by saving us from the terrors of the wailing death. Thank you. You honor me. Please, take this token to Yassam, uh, the druid, and uh, warn us well as a promise that we'll no longer join Luskin forces against them. Go with a blessing. Okay, so that's the thing that we needed then. That's pretty much all of them. We'll have to go back north one time. Which... I think I'm actually going to do right now. I'm going to level up first. Okay, Sorcerer. We have no reason to get Disable Trap, because anything that is above a DC 35, we literally can't do. And we can take a 20 at any point. Hold on, that's still only 24. Can we put points into that? Oh, it's take 20. So 24 plus 20. So that's, a, that. yeah, that's 31. Okay. All right. So anything above a 30, we can, we can take care of. Uh, let's get... Oh, we'll do that. Ooh, you know what, actually? Let's crank up our spellcraft. Heal is okay. Concentration is good. Lore is good. Do one more and heal. This heal's never a bad one to have. Hey, we get another feat. The heck do we want for our feet? This requires us to take another thing, which we're not going to do. Spell focus, or skill focus. Eh. Quicken spell might not be bad. Four levels higher than normal. That might not be bad. What does maximize spell do? Three levels higher than normal. Damage, number of targets, and so on, and their max values. Okay, so that is probably one of the better ones we can do. Disarm is useless in power spell. levels higher. I really like the idea of a maximized fireball. I think I'm going to take that. I can take two feats. So let's get the empower spell. I think maximize and empower is the ones that we want. Because all the rest of this is kind of it's kind of doo-doo. Rapid reload might be the best thing we could get to. Just because we can use more than one, but like... Our crossbow is really just a means to an end, you know? Like, it's not... It's not really... It's not really a thing we want. Uh... Lasting twice as long... Which isn't really great, considering we have to, like, sit down and stuff like that all the time anyways. The thing I think of is maybe some of the 24-hour buffs, but usually by the time I need to rest, it's because my uh, stone skin is done, so I don't think we need that. Um, point blank is just a plus one to attack. We're kind of... Yeah, you know what? Do give me the empowered spell. And we get level 8 spells. 
Perfect. Sunburst. Brilliant explosion occurs. 1d6 per caster level. Non undead creatures only summon 66. Vampires are destroyed instantly. Ooh. That's actually not half bad. Premonition. Allows the caster to see the future moments. Grants them damage reduction 30. Plus 5. Absorbs 10 point of melee damage per caster level before collapsing. That also sounds really good. If only I can see it. We have premonition, so we don't need premonition. And we don't need... What's the other level 8? Mass, blindness, and deafness? We don't need that one either, because we can get both of them. Greater Sanctuary. Okay. Black Staff. That's interesting. Plus four enhancement bonus. Striking creature, dispel magic is cast on it. That's actually really interesting. Create undead is kind of useless. We have horde wilting. Um, is there any level seven spells that we want? Control undead. That's not bad at all, actually. Held, um, be stunned for one round. Second creatures must make a fort save or be deafened by one minute. Third can make them all go prone. Eh, it's like good CC, but not really something I care about too much. Mind blank, one turn per level. Immune to all mind affecting things. That's actually kind of good too. Cindyary cloud. Again, that's kind of useless because it hurts my allies. All right, I'm thinking. Control undead is not bad, but I don't think I think we can usually get rid of undead pretty easily, so I'm not too worried about it. Sunburst, on the other hand, is a direct anti undead spell, which is pretty good considering there were a bunch of undead down there. Um. Mind Blank also just sounds really good. Is there any other spells that I want? Undeath to death? 1d4 hit die worth of undead creatures per caster. So this is just a big, huge AoE against undead? Dude. That's actually really good. Stone to flesh. Mmm. I don't know if we have that to worry about. Mmm. I don't know if we have that to worry about. I'm going to take undeath to death, I think. Sunburst also just sounds really cool, but... Are we going to use it? That's just like a big, huge chunk of damage. You know what? I'm going to take... I'm going to take Stone to Flesh. In the off chance that there is such a thing as, like, us just getting absolutely rocked from from that. I don't... I don't like the look of that, so... What do you even do, man? You do, like, actually nothing. Yeah, give me the panther, man. The panther's literally just better than you in every way. I think this guy's kind of tanky. Nope. I would rather take... a lot of stuff. Alright, give me the panther. Yes? Is there something you need? Ah, I just realized I'm supposed to be reading his story. His story is the one I want to read about. I'll talk for a while, okay. 
I promised to tell you the rest of the tale of Uthgar Spear when the time was right, Ateres. That time has come now. As you know, I'm on a vision quest to prove myself a true Uthgar warrior. Last night, I had a vision to guide me on my quest. Tell me about your vision. I have seen the spear in my dreams. According to the legends of my people, the Uthgar tribes will never be united until Uthgar spear is found. This is how I must prove myself worthy of my tribe. I must find Uthgar's spear, uh, though I do not know where to look. Do not fear. As long as you seek the words of power, my blade shall serve you. And in serving you, perhaps I will find the Uthgar spear. I've come to believe that it is the will of the gods and uh, that I stay by your side. You helped me find my mother's brooch. You avenged my, her murderer. Uh, I cannot help but feel you are destined to help me in this as well. I have a spear. Here it is. Is this Uthgar spear? Yes, this is the spear from my dreams. Uthgar spear. Because of you, I can return to my people with proof. My spirit is worthy of the Red Tiger tribe. I can never properly repay you for this gift, but please take the small token of my gratitude. It was a gift for my mother before she died. Nice. Thank you for this reward, Dalen. This talisman has powerful magical properties, though I know it is hardly a suitable reward for all you have done for me. Alas, it is the only thing I can offer you in my continued service. What are you going to do with the spear now, Dalen? I will bring Uthgar's spear back to my tribe, present it to our council of elders. I have no doubt they will declare my spirit worthy of the Red Tiger tribe. I imagine my chieftain will summon an intertribal council so that the Uthgar... Uh, tribes will know the artifact has been found. This is an event of great importance to my people. According to the legends, the return of Uthgar's spear heralds the return of Uthgar himself to be born among our tribes. They say it's a signal to return to the glory of our ancient past. What about you? I cannot say for certain. Perhaps I will be hailed as a hero and showered with riches and honors by my chieftains of my people. By the chieftains of my people. Crystal? Stop it. Stop it. Rat. You're just being a problem tonight, aren't you? Or perhaps I will simply be welcomed back into my tribe. The elders could allow me to take a wife and raise a son of my own amongst the Uthgar people. Either would be pleasing to me. I w have proven myself worthy, and for the first time, I truly feel at peace in a place, or with my place in this world. I'm going to miss you, Dalen. I long to return to my people and reclaim my place among my tribe, but I will not abandon you or break my promise to serve. As long as you have need of me, I will stay by your side and aid you in the search for the words of power. Only after they have been recovered will I return to my tribe. Nice. He can now return to his tribe. Except for the, when he dies like seven more times in the next chapter. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Gonna... Get it. My buffs are getting less and less useful, man. You know, it's starting to get to be one of those things. <laughs> Alright, so... Let's go back. We'll go up to the place we need to be. The creator thing. We'll turn in everybody's little side quest, because I think they're all done at this point. I'm pretty sure they're all going to be good to go. That. 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 Shape change I can never learn. Yes, I can. Druid level 9, I can learn it. And all this stuff. Red Dragon, Fire Giant, Baylor, Death Slade, Iron Golem. That I can learn. Weird, I think, is level 9. Time Stop is 9. I don't, I don't think that's use. Like, that's not useful at all to me. I can sell these. I don't know... Like, I guess that's not useful because I don't have allies. But. Oh well. And now the woman should be able to tell us about the, uh, the other things as well. Ah. Yes. During the sunrise, of course. Could be no time more pleasant than now to see the sun rising. A new day dawns as the alliance between the Uthgard Elk tribe and what is this place called? <laughs> Fort Ilkard begins. 
you say anything? Greetings. Must return to my duties. Doing what? All right, let's turn in all of this stuff. Like, finally turn on all of this stuff. Now that we're high enough level, we can actually do all of it. Okay, time to sell things. <laughs> we need that. We really don't need that. We don't need a second one, but I'm going to keep it anyways. Rags can get sold. Potion of speed. Get out of here. Want the summoning? Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Homestead Journal. We don't need that, but whatever. Bolt of Piercing will keep, because our guy will automatically swap to that. Okay, those are my wands. Alright, I think that's it. Alright, let's go turn in this stuff. Go talk to her about the creator thing. Who knows about the golems? Maybe she can give us a spell or... The key. Uh, this is Aaron Gen's place. Here we go. Excuse me, commoner. Do you not have any idea who I am? Tommy! Oh, wow, this is all so crazy. Okay, we're done. What can Tommy do for you? Body knock. Wow, wow, yeah. Dude, absolutely insane, man. Wow. Just truly substantial lore happening right now. Is there something? Is there something you need? Alrighty, look at all these things disappearing. Hey, what's up, Lenu? Yep. Anywho. <laughs> wow. Well, did you look at that? You're done. <laughs> Charwin, what's going on, sweetheart? Listen, I got some stuff that I got to give you, apparently. No. Jarwin, say it isn't so. The heck does she want? Song of Love. Hold on. I got an idea. It's called using Google to find what I need. Uh, Song of Love. Chapter 3. Uh, when you reach the creator ruins, you will find an item. Okay. So it's in... The creator ruins? Is it actually in there? Let me, let me pull this up quick, because there's like an actual guide on here that doesn't just tell you where to find it. Song is in a sarcophagus. Eastern room. Okay. So she's like literally the only one I need. Yes. Is there something you need? Uh, I think you're better off on my own. Yes, go. Okay. 
Dalen, my boy. I have been. Yes. Is there something you? Yep. 